Wait lang, maliligo lang ako and we're gonna start. We're gonna start our vlog. Uh, yeah. So as you can see, malapit na mag um, fall season dito. Kakatapos lang ng summer. Yung mga dahon sa mga puno, kahit green pa siya, nagsistart na siya maging brown. Tapos eventually, mawawala na yung lahat. So, tapos lalamig na yung panahon. And I'm very excited about that. Oops. Luluto lang ako ng bacon kasi nagugutom ako. Alas 12 na ng tanghali. Kakagising ko lang. So, I said, kakain muna ako bago tayo mag-start mag-vlog ulit. Breakfast, bacon, baboy, just like me, baboy. So, lalagyan lang natin ng konting aioli, which is garlic flavor. Hindi ko alam, parang garlic mayo lang yung lasa niya. And it's really good. Ah! Mainit! <laughs> Ang ganda ng natural lighting ngayon. Ah, no. Let's try. Oh. Oh. Okay na ba yung lighting o hindi pa? <laughs> Tignan yung, yung setup ko. Tcharan! Ano lang siya, lamp shade. Tapos nilagyan ko lang ng papel. Para hindi masyadong harsh yung lighting. So, bibili pa lang ako ng um, magandang ilaw with sana ring light or something like that. Para maganda yung, ano, yung, yung lighting pag nagbo-vlog. Kasi, um, kasi lighting is everything. Hindi magiging maganda yung balat mo, yung itsura mo pag pangit yung lighting. So... Okay, so today's video is gonna be me trying out new foods na hindi ko pa natatry. Number one, kasi nandito ako sa New Zealand and maraming international products ito including food. So, marami akong access to Indian food, Chinese food, Korean food, Japanese food, Mexican food. Reason number two, gusto ko mag-stay true to my channel name which is Asu... Gusto ko mag-stay true to my true Gusto ko mag-stay true to my channel name which is Usagi Adventures and uh, <laughs> and he need to magiging Usagi Adventures if I don't follow the meaning of the word adventure which is trying out new things. Diba? Makes sense. So here we go. I'm gonna try five that's 10. I'm gonna try 5 new foods na hindi ko pa natatry before. So help me God. Siyempre meron tayong um, regular Korean grape juice pang palate cleanser. In short, pag nasuso ka, ito na lang yung pampapigil. Hindi ko siya ma-open. I have a small hand. Ouch! Okay. There you go. Very nice. Not too sweet. So first item, since nagstart tayo sa Korean drink, ito Korean snack. Then I think it's called hot chicken flavor almond. So fin ko snack lang siya na spicy. So 
subukan nating amuyin. <coughs> Very nice smell. So, ito yung itsura niya sa loob. Mukhang regular almond lang yata siya. Uy! Ang spicy niya pala, pero masarap. Para siyang, yun nga, chicken flavor na parang barbecue na spicy. Tapos, hindi siya ordinary nut kasi almond nut. So, mas masarap yung flavor kumpara sa regular mani ng Pilipinas. Hindi ko lang inexpect na ano, na ganun siya ka spicy. Sarap, sarap. Maganda siyang i-partner sa ano pag gumiinom ka. Yung spiciness niya, saktong-sakto na pang tanggal ng umay sa lasa ng beer. So, I discovered a new best friend. I give that one 10 out of 10. Good job, Korea. Good job. Saranghe. Yo. Dahil, ano, hindi. Yun lang yung alam ko. May ano? Hindi naman kayo nagsabi na may beads pala ng... May ano pala, may pearls. This next item... Hindi ako sure kung nagugustuhan ko siya. Chinese food. Century egg. Hey Siri, what are century eggs? Century eggs, also known as preserved egg, hundredth year egg, thousand year egg, thousand year old egg, millennium egg. Skin and rice holds for several weeks to several months. The yolk becomes a dark green to gray color. Creamy consistency and strong flavor due to the hydrogen sulf. Okay. So yan yung itsura niya. Mukhang nakarap talaga siya. Ba't ganun? Ay! Nasa shell pa! Kaya pala matigas. Shit. Medyo nakrack ko na yata. Hindi <coughs> naman siya mabaho. Pinamoy ko yung nagcrack na part hindi naman siya mabaho talaga bubuksan lang natin akala ko yung century egg yung parang peeled na siya ay nako po teka tatapusin ko lang yung pag peel sa kanya yan na ba yun but parang yung ibang nakita ko sa TV parang shiny ah shiny nga grabe no naging black talaga siya insert heavenly music Pag malayo, yung amoy niyan, parang normal na ano lang, parang medyo mabaho. Pero yung sanay na ako kasi pinoy naman ako eh. Pero nung nilapit ko na yung ilong ko, may amoy ano, amoy niya. Yung parang ano, parang kilikiling mabaho na ano, 3 months na hindi nilinis. Delay delay tactics. How do I eat century eggs? Here's what I found on the web for how do I eat century eggs. Alright, so according to Cora.com, what is the best way to eat a century egg with your mouth? Any other orifice is just asking for trouble. <laughs> Usagi Adventures. Be brave. Be bold. Be beautiful. Ah. Parang siyang gelatin. Weird lang yung texture kasi imbis na yung normal na texture ng itlog. para siyang gelatin. See that? Kailangan ko yatang kagatin yung ano, yung egg yolk. Mm. 
surprisingly, okay lang siya. Um, yung lasa niya parang similar sa balut or para siyang salted egg pero hindi siya maalat. Parang wala lang siyang lasa. Makakain ko siya. Makakain ko siya. I like it. I like it. I like it. I like it. I'm gonna give it eight. Eight out of ten. Pusagi points. It's nice. Okay, next item. Vegemite. Vegemite B vitamins for vitality. Ang alam ko sa Vegemite para sa ang some form of spread for bread that you can only find in Australia or in New Zealand, I think. Hey Siri, what is Vegemite? Vegemite is a thick, black Australian food spread made from leftover brewer's yeast extract with various vegetable and spice additives. Made from... Ano daw yun? So, I guess it's made from vegetables and other plants. So, amoyin muna natin. I can definitely smell that it's salty. Kinda smells like fish. Okay, for the adventure, I bought banana. One, two, three. Mmm. Sino nagsabang ilagay niya yun sa sandwich o sa toast? <laughs> mga gago ang puta. Ba't hindi na lang pinagbata ilagay niyo sa toast? Ba't may mga ganito-ganito pa na hindi mo may... <laughs> Naiyak ako sobra. Ah, muntik na ako dun ah. Oh. Ah, adik ba kayo? Anong meron dyan? Anong ginawa nyo? Ba't naging ganyan yung lasa? Sobrang hindi ko maintain... One. One point. Diretso ka sa basurahan mamaya. Okay, next item. This one is from Japan. Pickled vegetables, Shiba Zuke. Shiba Zuke. Hey Siri, what is Shiba Zuke? You'll need to unlock your iPhone first. To go to mix vegetables, na nakapiko. I don't know. Di ko siya maopen. Open sesame. Yan yung Itsura sa loob. Nya. Mukhang pepino yata. Or mushroom. Tinkamas. I think we're gonna be okay with this one. Salty. May konting asin. Medyo crunchy. Masarap. I give this one a solid 7. Okay lang. This one, so this last item is from India. Ang tawag sa kanya, Baingan Barta. Baingan Barta. So, roasted eggplant mash cooked with fresh gar- No preservatives, 100% vegetarian, no added MSG. Okay, microwave. I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. Yan. Yan yung itsura niya. Delivered or not, hindi pa ako nakatry ng proper Indian food. Siguro yung the closest thing pa lang sa natikman kong Indian is um, samosas, bawang, paminta. Yan. That's it. <laughs> Feeling ko okay naman yung lasa. Kasi it's just eggplant with garlic and spices.
too much salt. Hindi ko na malasaan yung lasa ng eggplant, which is sad. Kasi masarap naman yung lasa ng talong eh. Hmm, I give this a 4. Not so impressed. So there you have it guys. I tried 5 different international food na hindi ko pa na-try before. The winner for me is this. So guys, that's gonna be the end of this video. I hope you like it. And if you did, please comment down below what you think. And if you wanna see more of this kind of content, sabihin nyo lang and I will gladly oblige, obey, follow. And kung hindi ka pa nakapag-subscribe, please. And bago ka umalis at tuloy na akong kalimutan, please follow my social media here and here. So we can be friends there. And once again, thank you for watching. Ingat ka. And I'll see you on the next video.